all right folks so what is going on today we are going back in with some more vendred zombies and we're definitely playing on dueling book again because uh yeah this is just you know where we need to be so <clears throat> pretty much i'm doing some testing i'm trying to see our different builds now somebody did suggest adding a gofu and a dragon's mirror i couldn't find really too much room for the dragon mirror because the extra deck is so tight for some reason konami did not bump it up which i don't understand why they didn't because you're coming out with a new mechanic that literally what it says is you got to extend your play so i don't know if they just want people to stop playing extra deck cards but with links being out man and, and like with with the gofu being in the deck our, our deck is really limited so i'm not able to add dragon's mirror right now but next week i'll definitely test and see what we can do with that so as you can see i did i opened up pretty decent i you know i i, I really do like this hand because i have a wave force slayer i have a unizombie I also have a swallow slash so I can definitely get rid of my opponent's board and have an ash blossom just just in case they have something that they want to draw or search that I really do not feel like dealing with as of right now so as you can see I opened up my play I was thinking about dumping hound horde because I did want to establish a slayer on board and especially a slayer slayer with hound horde's effect also with a swallow slash face I mean with a swallow slash down there and an ash blossom in hand that's pretty good we you know because if we play against true dracos or something we can definitely banish one of their spells if we play against uh zodiacs we can banish a barrage there's a whole mess of things we can do and as you can see he started off with a terraforming so here i'm thinking all right uh my default answer is always true draco and it turns out to be true draco uh because man is if you go on dueling book right now everybody in ranked is playing true draco zoo this deck needs to, the band list needs to already hurry up and get out here so we can get rid of this deck. Um, I actually like playing against it because, you know, well, I don't like playing against it, but I'd rather play against this than play against something random so I can test how my deck does against the meta. So he starts off with a Thoroughblade, discarding another Thoroughblade to draw a card. Then he activates the diagram. So here I'm thinking, all right, I think I'm going to have to, you know, use my Swallow Slash. He's probably going to try to pop in his hand, but no luckily we get um we, get, we do get the benefit of him setting a card so now when he activate activates the diagram effect we can pop both of those and then banish the spirit master to go ahead and pop his um or at least attempt to pop his zodiac so he will not be able to extend his plays so here we go we're going to banish the spirit master accidentally sends it to the grave but you guys understand what's going on here so i'm activating the effect of master and i'm thinking please please let this go through because like if I get my body or something, we're just not we're just not in a good position. But um, we do get lucky that he do, that it, he does not have a my body or that Fortissimo card or something like that. And then he activate Pot of Desires, which is beautiful because Ash Blossom is right in my hand. We can definitely negate, and we're just in a great position right now. We got really pretty much everything on his field. He only has two cards to my two cards, but I do have a Mizuki, so I can definitely get uh, I can get somewhere. And then since i do have the mizuki and i can just go ahead and send the sage and then because i have the vendred cards in my hand i can definitely account for you know 3900 but we draw solitaire so i mean now that's guaranteed 3900 all we need is 49 and you, i mean 41 extra 100 and you guys already know we can definitely put that on the board so activate my solitaire and i give him a chance to respond but for some reason not for some reason but a lot of people on dueling book when you get on here, you just got to have patience, man. You just really got to have patience because a lot of people, they don't like to talk. They don't like to announce their effects. They don't like to type. It's just a whole bunch of stuff, man. People will call you out your name. Uh, that's just, um, it's just how it is. But we're not going to be worried about that right now. I'm still giving him the chance. And then I'm going to ask him one more time because I'm like, if this plays go through, we can, we can get game. I can get game if this play goes through. So ask him, is it good again? Uh, he says nothing, so I said, all right, well, fuck it. I'm just going to do my own play. So I'm going to search through my deck, get a Unizombie, and here I'm thinking about how, I mean, I'm thinking about how to get game. I know I can I know I can put 39 on board. That's a guarantee, but can I put the extra 41? Um, so I summon Unizombie, and I believe I send, I think I send Gozuki, because that would be the best. I think that, yeah, that's the best option. If, if I don't send Gozuki, I, I just... I just have a problem here, but I should be sending Gozuki. Um, I check my graveyard once again to make sure I got a Mizuki in there. Um, where is the Gozuki at? I was thinking about Goblin Zombie. Goblin Zombie would have been a good card, but we're not really. Uh, see, what I was thinking here is I could summon Goblin Zombie, 
use origin to uh tribute goblin zombie banish solitaire or special but like what do we need to and then search gozuki that was going on in my head but then i thought to myself i said i could just send gozuki and you know we can continue our plays so here i banish uh banish mizuki for gozuki use gozuki's effect and i think i'm going to dump smith here because i'm still thinking that you know i'm gonna be uh pretty much i'm still thinking that uh he's gonna have something to stop it so i use uh origin to go ahead and banish a solitaire and smith and this is why i really think that the share news are really important with vendreds uh, even though they really conflict because you do need your Vend you do need the like the vendred monsters to get the effects but also the, the the fact that you can banish the cards from your graveyard and they trigger this uh, the Shiri news is just so good. So here I use Smith um, in solitaire because I'm trying to play around Ghost Ogre because if he Ghost Ogres me, we're just in trouble. So I think that's the reason why I did not use um, Smith. I think I did not use Master because I am playing around Ghost Ogre. And so right here, <clears throat> I can use Sun Saga as Chainlink 1 and Smith as Chainlink 2 and pretty much um that is game he cannot chain goes over to it so here we go to the deck profile as you can see here like i said i added the gofus and stuff like that and you can see i did add dark hole and stuff so yeah that is uh it for today hope you guys did enjoy the video leave your comments down below what you guys would like to see me uh add to the deck or you know what changes you guys are making in your own deck or you know whatever you guys do want to say so yeah thank you guys for watching if you guys would like to support the channel all i ask is if you guys can click and add and that'll be enough for me. So thank you. And I will see you in a couple of hours with the next duel.